Welcome back to the Law Starts Street Lash channel. My name is Anna and today we're going to be chatting about how to avoid the bottom layer lashes from drooping into the client's eyes. Okay, so the first reason why this can happen is if the extensions are too heavy for the natural lash to support. This can be from using too long of lengths or too high of a dimension or diameter. It's not super uncommon that clients have weaker natural lashes along that bottom layer. So it's definitely a great idea to assess the bottom layer and if you're ever unsure, you can always play it safe and use lightweight dimensions and diameters on the bottom layer only. The next reason why this can happen is if we use the wrong curl. Some clients have downturn natural lashes across the eye, or even some clients have downturn lashes on just the bottom layer. For these clients, you definitely want to avoid using a weaker curl because if you do, that curl is going to swoop down with the natural lashes and obstruct the client's view. So definitely opt out for a stronger curl, even if it's just along that bottom layer. Another reason why we may experience droopy lashes is if the extensions have been placed a little bit too far away from the lash line. This can happen because the base of the natural lash is much sturdier than closer to the tips. And if we apply our extension too close to the tips, that part of the natural lash may not be sturdy enough to support the extension. At Lost Artistry, we aim to place our extensions 0.5 millimeters away from the skin and on sensitive clients about a millimeter away. And when it comes time for fills, we'll remove the extensions that begin to twist and turn and the ones that look too far away from the lash line. Lastly, we have rogue lashes. These are those annoying little lashes that are often found sitting above the top layer or below the bottom layer. And they are the lashes that often throw off the aesthetic of our set when we lash them. If you lash a rogue lash above the top layer, it's not the end of the world. You can use your discretion whether or not you want to remove it or keep it. But when it comes to the rogue lashes located below the bottom layer, we definitely suggest not lashing them because they sit too close to the waterline. And if we lash them, they can of course droop the eyes and cause irritation to our clients. Thanks so much for checking out this quick video. Don't forget to double tap and check out our page for more free lash content. We'll see you on the next video.